Hello grade 10s and welcome to today's lesson on rounding off. Rounding off a decimal is a technique used to estimate or approximate values. Instead of having a long string of decimal places, we can approximate the value of the decimal to a certain number of decimal places. In order to round off to a certain number of decimal places, you need to look at the decimal place to the right of the set. For example, to round to two decimal places, we need to look at the value of the digit in the third decimal place to tell us whether to round up or not. If the number in the third decimal place is equals to or greater than 5, the digit in the second decimal place will round up to the next digit. If the number in the third decimal place is 4 or less than 4, then the digit in the second decimal place remains the same. This is often called rounding down. Let's do a couple of examples to help us. We are going to round off the numbers 0, 25382 to 3 decimal places. We see that 3 is in the third decimal place. This means we must look at the digit to the right of the 3, which is 8. Because 8 is greater than 5, we need to round up. This means that the third digit must be increased by 1. Once this is done, all the other digits must be dropped. Thus, 0, 25382 is approximately equal to 0, 0,254. Now let's try an example where we will have to round down. We are going to round 2,361 to two decimal places. The digit 6 is in the second decimal place position. To see how we should round it off, we look at the digit to the right of the 6 which is 1. Because 1 is smaller than 5, we must round down. This means the 6 will remain 6. Thus, the answer is 2,36. You will be required to round off when you get an answer that has many decimal places. And the instructions for the question will tell you how many places to round off to. If this is not given, the standard rule is to round off to two decimal places. Most importantly, remember to only round off your final answer and never round off in the middle of the calculation. Remember to try the task video at the end of this section. You'll also be able to learn more about algebraic expressions on our website www.mindset.co.za forward slash learn. Thank you for joining us, great teens.